My name is Kathy, and I lived on the route of the Dakota Access Pipeline when it came through Iowa. It was an ugly, ugly thing to witness. Mm -hmm. I saw the entire thing being yep. installed. We fought it hard, and we're still fighting it here in the Iowa courts. President Obama shut it down at one point, mm -hmm. but that all changed after 2016. Would you, and how would you, as president, shut down the Dakota Access Pipeline and prevent further similar projects? Well, to be honest, you'll have to talk to me about this because I'm unfamiliar with the circumstances of it right now. I don't know what the legal status is. Okay. But I can tell you that I have uh, taken what I thought are responsible decisions not to embed infrastructure <coughs> that would be so long in the future of fossil fuels that would lock us into a disastrous course. So most recently, I was a vocal opponent of the Trans Mountain Pipeline in British mm -hmm. Columbia that would have created a lot more oil refinery traffic. We're trying to recover our orcas and killer whales right now. The last thing we need is another oil spill. All right, through my uh, uh, facility siting policy, uh, I denied the largest export facility mm -hmm. on the West Coast. Uh, it will not be built now. So I have, in the appropriate circumstance, been willing to stand up to say we have to be cautious about locking in a future that would doom us uh, to horrendous uh, losses. And so I've been willing to do that on multiple occasions. I look forward to, to talking with you about that. I'll do that. <laughs> if it's on the election, might not, might, maybe not, but I'd be interested. No, no, it's sometime next month, the month after? Yes, I'd like to bring talk. Bring 50 to 100 people to talk to talk I about I would like to be talked to any forum to talk about this issue. And this fellow right here, Ben, will talk to you okay. about that. Great. We'd obviously be interested in any communities that you need to us to uh, help educate me because I came here to listen as much as to talk. Uh, with I think the, that's very important. With the help of Channing and a bunch of other people, yeah. about 35 of us walked across the country in 2014. Get out of here! 2014, yeah. That's awesome. So from one author to another, that's the memoir from the. I Grand appreciate Marshall it, but you know, as an author, I only buy books. I don't take them. You need a royalty on this. So <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> thank, thank you.